awakening in order to get onto the diffuser here. Amipi is going to be spotted on the outside. Scyther takes the duel and wins it. But now is the hard part. Now he's going to deal with the player upstairs, and this is not going to be an easy factor at all. He does not have the Nitro Cell to confirm the easy kill. He's gonna... Oh! Oh, what is this? There's oh, no way good. that Leon's going to be able to read into this. Maybe he has. No, he's noticed it. The nade goes in. It's going to oh. impact. It should connect. But no! Not in time! Just a moment too late! An Empire! Three billion IQ from Scyther to clutch out the round! to start off your very first attack. That's the tempo that you want to set, and especially beneficial given that you just took your tactical timeout. Yuna getting the plant down while Cameraman watches Shepard. That's the connector player, as I said, and the uh -oh. evil eye will zap away, but it's not doing any damage. No, no damage. Or is it frozen? What is going it's on? Frozen. Oh, it's, we've. Yeah, we've crashed. That is a heartbreaker because. It, on the From the look on Mav's face, I think Empire might have won it because I think this might be a spectator problem. But I don't know. It could be everyone's crashed. We're going to find out. We're waiting for confirmation. Uh, I think it crashed because it looked like Joystick's computer Oh yeah, had it frozen on the same thing as us. Okay, then it's... Uh... That's a heartbreaker for FaZe if that's the case because that is almost indisputably a FaZe round. Is it five versus two? For in favor of phase. Five versus two. And they're planting. And they're He's got a good line of sight to try and poke some holes in this defense just inside of Garage. And phase are set up well, but so are Empire as we hit the last 35 seconds. Very well played by Dan, who takes out Yuna and then swings up. Oh, Dan comes alive as he always does. No and way. No way. Not again. Now it's Empire's turn to be upset as a pretty admirable job. This is kind of his own personal comfort map, or at least it's been the map where I've personally seen the most potential from this man. So he's doing a lot. He's got Cameraman watching Oil Pit very intently. And Joystick is just waiting for Cameraman to possibly rotate. Oh, what a shot that was from Joystick to absolutely silence Cameraman. But there's the cab, and are we gonna see it? Yes, cheer loud, interrogation for Astro. Empire, oh my, you just have to sit and wait with Shepard and Karzeka there. And you can see the look on Astro's face as the celebratory fist bump. To the groove. And the problem here is that Farrell's playing deep up front. I think he was over by ATMs, yes. by, if it looked like it. Which means that his return to the site is going uh -oh. to be challenging, and he's detected this is not good. He knows he's got somebody <gasps> inside a garage, yes. and he might be able to capitalize on it. Oh, he gets the down, and are we about to see it? Yes, ladies and gentlemen, interrogation! Farrell will get him. Goodbye, Slash, all alone in the garage. And the remaining members of Rogue are going to need to try to get out of Dodge. Bonkers, very aggressive on Shuttle. He'll throw one grenade, and he can't finish him off quite yet. He knows he's got the down, and there we go. He's coming through, but definitely not going to be able to take down Corey's. The Diffuser will be successfully planted. Aces, still plenty of time as well. That C-75 could definitely help out in those close-range engagements. Canadian now rotating over through Cigar. Long rotation here, has a shot, but Corey, oh my god, that reaction! What? One bullet is all he needs! <laughs> that was absolutely insane. Just flick the one tap. Whoa. Oh my god! <laughs> that was dirty. Thank you so much, gentlemen. Here's Pangu with G2 Esports, ladies and gentlemen. What happened? I, what, what did I do wrong? Well, you obviously don't know me then, because I'm Fabian. Fabian, oh my god, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Well, I specifically asked for Pengu, but you know, I'm still learning. Hey, I'm still learning! This is my first time here, folks, so you know, you gotta you know, give me a little, give me a little slack. Give me a little slack. Fabian, it's a pleasure to have you here, my friend. I'm so sorry about that. Uh, get me to buy some, like, herbal tea or something. Uh, so now, you have to match up against Force tomorrow. Force have been on a hot streak as of late, and you guys have just consistently played well on land, time in and time again. Do you feel like you, this, this team is the team that is gonna pretty much put out the fire that Force has started here in Raleigh? I don't know if Force is a fire, but every team that's gone up against them have played literally fucking shit. That's fair. From all of these remaining members, they have all their hard destruction as well as a will in order to get it through. Oh, going to get them both as Rampy does the Electro Shuffle impact through. He's literally dealing with every single oh piece of God. equipment that they're throwing at him. Rampy is an absolute madman. He's shuffling everything, and he gets the Excyros. Oh, my God, Rampy, you absolutely...
absolute monster with utility and weapons. He's got it all. Canadian's what? gonna blow himself up. What is happening? What is this game? Close. M King with a nitro cell to take down Bio. It's all left up to Pojo, man. It's a veteran player. He takes down one. He has one to find with only 10 seconds. He has to do it with a goo mine in his foot. Make it two as PX just laying down behind the bar. And he finds him. PX, no, don't run. TSM with round one as Pojo laughs hysterically and drops the law. He drops the law, ladies and gentlemen. You can't do that on land. What are you doing? Welcome back to TSM versus MIBR. We've on? been through map whatever. Okay, whoa. Okay. Bolo. Ooh. Oh, oh, Pojo? Okay. Getting Bolo ready. Gotta stretch him out, man. Gotta stretch him out. Right Get it. Stretch out the stretch out the legs a little bit. You know, those really helping those real gamer hours. Always, always good things coming with there's a foot massage. Yeah, always always good things coming. You guys can expect Bolo to play the best game he's ever played. All those nerves are gone. The foot massage from Poge helping out just a little bit, but Pojo not able to find him. It's gonna be all up to Merc. They're going to have him on the Yokai's though. As he will knock down one. Does he get the second? He will. That's gonna be the diffuser as well. Merc on a triple because he's gonna have to try and ace it out to win this. Hasn't shown too much face so far in Border Scyther's going to don the mantle though and starts to put that diffuser down. They do have Karzeka holding an angle inside of server though. Hop through this wall is going to be the toughest part. Those last two kills though, that's that pre-game I was talking about the pre-game for Merc. It's next level as he finds yet another kill on the cusp of an ace now. Just needs one more and look at how low Karzeka is. In fact, I think he knows where he's at. He's got a general idea anyway. Went for the pre-fire. He doesn't know if he's outside or hiding on the inside though. He'll be on the other side of this server block waiting for him. And meanwhile, the diffuser waits around the corner. The problem for Merc is he doesn't seem to have the intel and there's so many different positions where Karzeka could be playing into. No reason for him to peek right now. A drone was just spotted out. Less than a quarter of the time left, and Karzeka, he doesn't catch the foot around the server block and throws away the potential ace clutch, giving yet another round to Empire. Storing up, but only takes about 5 HP off of Leon. So he's content to hold this, the charge through the smoke, unsuccessful for Rampy. Looking to line up another one will be Leon Gids with the TCSG. Another one comes into his sights and another one meets his maker. Bosco to fall into 3v5 now for Space Station as they continuously try to push up the endless utility being dumped at the top of the curved stairs. And this will now force Charla and Fultz to slow down a little bit as they keep throwing their lives away one by one up the stairs. The combination of Leon and EP just holding the top is working so good, but Fonkers goes down at least. But that's not the, the players you need the kills on at this point. Uh, South stairs flank though from Fultz as he pushes up, so they level on man count. Thinking they low on HP, but still holding the elevator right now is Leon. You guys have the Alda in front of the front desk right now, and low on time right now are Space Station Gaming. Thinking they still on the North Repel. There goes Fultz, so it's off the trolley inside the building right now. Swung on now by Leon, thinking they with one, and they know they have Diffuser. All right. Kix, you look like you just rolled out of bed this morning. I, I did. I did. I put in no effort today. At all. This is, this is you with no effort. It's quite nice, though. You got the nice shoes on. You got the robe and glasses at the very... Oh, oh. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. I wonder if that's a, a Pengu or a Fabian jer uh, jersey. Kappa. Uh, it's my own. I was going to wear an NA jersey, so at least they'd be on this. So now we have coaches to pick. We got two options here. Kicks, who's the coach for your team? Kizoku. Kizoku! Whoa! Kizoku boss, ladies and gentlemen. Kizoku. Go. Can I have a mic again? What, what happened? Can, can I have a mic again? 10 seconds. Go, go, go. Okay. Hello, America! Hello! Do you love Rainbow Six TV? And do you love me? Woo! I love America too, yeah! Other things where TSM is currently in the lead up against the Russian machine and might have this first. Oh, machine. what? Where was that <laughs> nitro cell? What in the hell was that? That was okay. All right. Well, that was like 800 rotation. IQ yeah, with that one right yeah. there. Immediate <laughs> rotation as well by the likes of Murky is going to be play playing the vigil this time around, recognizing how the team empire has done quite a good job. Oh, he had the nitro cell placed over on mini bar. Mmm. He doesn't actually need to... Well, okay, Leon's gonna get an early pick there onto Slash. There goes your castle. Leon's just on Repel here on the west window. Good job to uh, to him. First, an early kill. 
they knew that there was somebody playing there as the castle barricade falls. And everybody's just getting in on the action now. It's back to a 2v2, so that hurricane wow. will actually favor Rogue. Vertical stepping up really big when they need him, leaving Feral in a 1v2. Vertical coming alive, waking up. Oh, he's given a bullet for his troubles, or multiple actually from Feral. And it's Feral versus Easley in a 1v1. To see if the head will pop up above the wall. Farrell will give his position away. Keep in mind the ARX in the hands of Nomad has a tiny, tiny magazine. But so does the SMG 11. Easily moves, gives himself away, and he gets baited right in. It's another round for Secret, who 